A teenager from Ukraine finding safety in southeast Wisconsin. That 14 year old refugee has just started school in Kenosha. After Russia invaded, he lived in an underground shelter for two weeks. Then he made a 5,000 mile journey to live with his godmother. Stephanie Haynes shares his amazing story. 14 year old Arseny Holobov is wearing the last thing he grabbed before escaping his home in Ukraine. Are, are these the clothes you from Ukraine or yes. These, yes. these are the clothes you wore yeah. and that was all you had? Yeah, pretty much this in your papers. Yes, Arseny is living in Kenosha with his godmother Irina Falk. She moved to Kenosha from Ukraine back in 2005. What has the past few weeks been like? It, it was terrible. Uh, first days, it was very scary. Arseny grew up in Cherniev. It's a city not far from Kyiv and under constant attack. He remembers the day it began. I was at home. My mom get up me at five o'clock and say and said that war has started. Get up and uh, uh, pick up your clothes. They raced to an underground bunker where they stayed for at least 14 days. Four meters underground, you could still hear the bombs. Yeah. Were you scared? Mm, yeah. Then the drive to Warsaw, Poland took three days. And the very next day, Arseny was on a flight to the United States alone. His mother and older brother are staying behind to help in Ukraine. Oh, you hugged your family goodbye and got on the plane? Yes, it's... Uh, Did he, he says, I was very sad. Yeah. To, yeah that I have to do it. Arseny flew into O'Hare Airport in Chicago last Friday and Monday was his first day at Bradford High School. Irina says she hopes to get Arseny into playing tennis. She says they constantly FaceTime Arseny's mother and she stresses how brave she is for helping her little boy escape. She's a hero, definitely. Ukrainian women are strong women. They all hope they can go back to Ukraine and be together one day. In Kenosha, Stephanie Haynes, TMJ4 News.